and let's take the persistent toxic materials because they are the ones that are causing the problems for the degradable ones once they enter the environment they are broken down now the first persistent toxic material we're going to take is mercury over here we see the droplets of mercury now we know mercury is a planet we also have mercury that is an element mercury is a metal but it is liquid at room temperature just as you can see in this test tube the commonest place you can find mercury is inside the bulb of a thermometer so in the bulb of a thermometer we have mercury in there the mercury is the one that rises and then falls in response to the temperature mercury compounds are used were used on quite recently to make paints for boats and then insecticides so the boats that were moving on rivers had mercury paints and then even the insect insecticides used for killing insects also had mercury now when mercury enters the food chains instead of being broken down it is not since it is not degradable it accumulates instead of mercury getting broken down it accumulates and then when it gets to a point it damages the nervous and reproductive systems of humans and other mammals